Hi everyone! Thanks for joining us here at Somerset Place for the first installment of our series about the enslaved community in 1843. The house you see here is a reconstructed two-story dwelling known as the Suki Davis Home, named for its oldest resident and matriarch. Since this house is part of our guided tour, we're starting our series with the structure that stood next door, the Mac and Penelope Treadwell House, which looked exactly the same. A total of 26 enslaved persons lived in this structure, ranging in age from approximately 2 years old to 54 years old. Mac and Penelope occupied a first floor room with their 2 year old daughter, Hannah Payne. Mac, a carpenter, who was the oldest person living in this dwelling, was a widower when he married Penelope, 28 years his junior. He had four other children, including his namesake son, so he was listed as Old Mac on the inventory to distinguish between them. Across the hall from Mac and Penelope were Alex Millen, Mary Newbel, and their four daughters, Harriet, Emmeline, Jane, or and Corinna, all 13 years and younger. Mary, 31 years old at the time, was the child of Newbel and Lucy Lake, so her surname was recorded as her father's name to distinguish her from other Marys in the enslaved community. She and her husband, who was 10 years her senior, later became communicants of the Lake Chapel and had twins in 1845, one of whom tragically passed away in 1857. Mary herself is presumed to have died during the Civil War, but her family's life after emancipation is unknown. We do know that almost every household in this dwelling was impacted by the inheritance division discussed in our introductory video. Mac, Penelope, and Hannah were inherited by Louisa Collins and her husband, Thomas Harrison. When the couple moved to Alabama several months after this inventory was compiled, Mac's family was forcibly uprooted from their home at Somerset Place and relocated with them. As we'll see throughout the series, no family was left unscathed by the forced migration to Alabama, including others in the Treadwell home. We'll cover the other two rooms of this dwelling in our next video, and to find out when that's posted, click the subscribe button and the bell to receive notifications. And until then, thanks for tuning in.